Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Let's Play Theotown. So, we did a first look at this game, had a lot of fun, really enjoyed it. So we're going to start a new single city. Region is a great way to build like a large region over time and like having little individual cities, which I think is pretty cool. And uh, you can have a lot of fun, you can share your power and water and things like that. But the reason we're going to do single city is because for a Let's Play series, they feel like the region will be too much up and down. Like, oh, we'll build this in a couple episodes and then, oh, we're going to move to a new tile and start fresh kind of thing i don't think that's as fun for my personal taste uh, so i think i'm going to just do the single uh city which they're pretty big pl uh big maps basically so we're going to go giant we're going to also turn off hills hills aren't like really crazy or anything like that but it just makes building a little easier i mean trees and decorations off heck makes even building even easier uh but uh i'm not going to go that crazy so i'm going to look for something very greeny hopefully here so we're just going to hit this uh dice basically and look for something like that kind of um actually that's kind of cool i'll do that one because there's some water we can use that in the future if we want and uh yeah cool and then we're gonna go to middle here so basically the difference between easy and middle is well i feel like it's a big difference here uh basically easy uh i think it you, you you basically things might be a bit cheaper things like that but the middle one uh things are you know default that's what they suggest but there's a time build on things so let's just say there's like a riot and fire and things going on you need maybe police and fire to be you know sent out well if you don't have enough coverage what will end up happening is you will have a lot of destruction and you know a lot of problems in your city so um you would place your fire and your police instantly. But the thing is, it has a build timer on it. So the build timer is going, you know, the police can't get out there. You have to wait till it builds and it might take three months or whatever. So kind of kind of cool in that sense that uh, adds like that more, you know, challenge to it. Beyond, we're going to call it Beyond, August 14th. I'm really excited about No, no Man's Sky is Beyond. So I'm just going to call it literally Beyond August 14th. <laughs> <laughs> maybe a bit lame but uh i'm excited for it so let's uh let's start shall we my friends so there we go and we are we're in so uh you can build wherever you want so i won't touch the waterfront or any water area for a while just because i feel that'll be useful later on because i get to play with it and have fun with it but you know i think it's it's more valuable as well later on um because, you know, you can build, like, more expensive houses near the water area and things like that. So that's pretty cool. So let's just get started, honestly. Uh, I guess the first thing you want to do is go to supplies. And we'll get our energy supply going here. And you can just place your solar panels down. And uh, so we'll just get a couple of them here. I like how we're already having our drains. So you might want to pause it. Because if you're not having anybody moving in right away, what's the point wasting it? So I'm already over probably building here. Uh, we'll go up and we'll go to, oops, uh, supplies, water, and we'll get a couple of these going as well. I'll just place them like this. Yeah, I'm already blowing off my cash just for fun. Uh, just <laughs> I know there's no need to quite do what I'm doing, but I'm just having fun. And then I guess the next thing I'll do is uh, build some like residential, honestly. Start just getting the building going. So uh, we'll, we'll have these kind of off the side a bit. I don't think these require any roads near them. So we're going to go to roads. Uh, by the way, I'll use shortcuts. So, for example, R is roads. So there you go. You get your dirt road. And uh, we'll give it a bit of space. I think space is important in these games at times. Just so, you know, you have uh, a bit of room. And then we'll go, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Well, actually, one, two, three, four. Yeah, I think when you start off, they can't build that big, right? So you're going to probably want something where they they have room for their stuff. But there you go. And then we're going to go to zones. I'm going to click some of them, and then eventually I'll start using the, the shortcuts more. Oh, so you see this? It auto-builds roads for you, which is kind of cool. It could be useful. You can build this whole area, and it'll put the roads in. Or you can click this off, and it'll get rid of the roads, and you can build it however you want, which is kind of what I want anyways. And then we're going to hit U for utilities, or the water, I guess, sorry. And then we're going to bring this down. And then one, two, three, four, I think. You can only do like that. I don't know if it goes out more. We'll find out in a second. No, I think that was a good call. And there you go. So, of course, already people are coming into our town. So, uh, our taxes are pretty good. They're at 7%. We'll probably leave them there for now. 
Uh, eventually, we might want to raise them or lower them, however we feel, but uh, I think that's good. And then, uh, yeah, let's just keep going here. So I'm going to make a road, and we're going to bring this in. So we're going to bring this into five out, and we're going to bring this in, and uh, there you go. And we'll just get a bit of commercial, so we hit Z here. And then, yeah, we're just going to start uh, just plowing through here and getting things going. And then um, there's buildings without water. Oh, yeah, because of our new buildings, of course, derp. So we're going to go and bring this down here. And then, of course, you want to bring in water wherever you can. There you go. There you go. And uh, we've unlocked a statue. So we can build a little statue, which will probably make people happy-ish and stuff like that. So it's like a why not kind of thing. Kind of cute and silly at the same time. You see the traffic and everything going. So yeah, the power jumps, by the way, if you didn't know that. So if you click energy, uh, I guess this is a good way of clicking energy. Or you can click the other thing for energy. But uh, radioactive, that's kind of cool. I'm actually having a problem finding electricity here. Probably just be... Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Probably just easier to go up here and... Oh, I'm clicking the wrong stuff now. Uh, just energy through here. There you go. And you can see it jumps kind of. If it's nearby, it works, so... Um, so it's, it's suggesting that, you know, I consider building some industries, which I do want to build, but, uh, I also want to get more, uh, people in here. So what we're going to do first is go to roads and we're going to increase this. So how, how big is this? If we go from here to here, that's 12, right? So, hmm, I'm trying to figure out, uh. Is it, would it be 11 then out? I don't really know, to be honest. We'll just do it the same amount, or at least attempt to. So we'll go from here to 12. I don't actually know if I'm getting the right numbers here, but uh, I'm just going to expand this for now. And uh, so, we'll, yeah, we'll do the same thing here. And then uh, let's bring this out for by four. How much money do we have? We should have enough. Three, four. Okay, and then we'll bring this one up to here. And there you go. And then we'll do these little inner crosses here. And then, yeah, we'll zone this up like crazy. So we're going to bring in residential and we're going to bring it from here to here. And then we're going to bring commercial and we're going to bring it from here to here. And we'll leave the other road for now. We're going to use the rest for water if we don't have enough yet. So we need to bring some water in and then we'll bring some water over here. Okay, so in a sense now we're just going to let it blast and hopefully uh, we'll bring in that moolah here in a second. So just because we're going to need to bring in some more money, might even bring up the taxes a bit more um, just so we can get a little extra for a bit. I know they won't be as happy, but uh, we really do need to uh, increase some of that stuff. So we can go to, we haven't ranked up yet, by the way, so we have to rank up, of course, over time. I'm just thinking we might as well make them a little happy, maybe with some parks and stuff like that. That's if we can make a park yet. And yeah, apparently we can. So we'll go ahead and put a park over here. Put it in the commercial area. Uh, maybe we'll put one here. One over here somewhere. There you go. You're just making people happy, right? So there you go. Maybe even put one over here just to offset it a bit. I think the parks are pretty cheap anyways per month, so it's not like you're you're you know dying. If you click here and look at here, parks costing us ten T a month, so and we're making over a one K. So that is that is just, you know, scratching the surface in a sense. We need some money because we wanna make industry. We don't want industry to be too close as well, so we're gonna have to bring it further out. Uh, so, uh, now that we are getting there, so R for roads, and I'm thinking, I want to build this road out, I'll probably build it out to here somewhere, uh, kind of, kind of want it on its own, just away, oh, it's not too, uh, bad, bring it really up high then, we're gonna have to bring electricity up there as well, so I think, uh, yes, okay, yeah, so they want to light industry. Basically, we're not going to expand without industry at this point, it sounds like. So we're going to bring wires up here as well. So we're going to just go here, and we're going to bring it all the way up here with the road. Um, hopefully, that's not too expensive. 2K. A wee bit expensive, but 
not life threatening. And then we're going to build a new road system up here. So uh, let's start with this one. And I'm going to just slightly, the I'm going to bring down the volume in this game just a wee bit. It's just, just a wee bit. The birds are annoying me. Oh, wow. I guess I could turn down the game too. I think I'm too loud personally. And so um, I think that's why we're doing that. Okay, roads. Here we go. So we're going to bring this out. And um, yeah, I guess it doesn't really matter. Bring it out here. And then we're going to do one, two, three, four. There you go. And then we can just bring it out here for now. And uh, yeah, somewhere in, I know in here somewhere. So yeah, I can't see it from there because I can't see the numbers. I guess you can use this as a math thing, right? So 26. So I don't know, we'll just do it around here. Ah, roads, there you go. I know that's not perfectly even or whatever, but uh, and then we're gonna put the zone and then we're gonna put industry and we're just gonna put it in here. And then put another industry here. Oh, we don't have enough money. The thing is, we want to get uh, the water up here as well. So keep that in mind. Um, so I'm not sure how this is going to cost us. There you go. There you go. Because we want to make sure we get uh, that up. And then overall, um, our cost will go up because everything's going to go up. And there we go. So we just made it to Hamlet. We got a road here, a country road. They're a little faster. A neighborhood church, a neighborhood mosque, wind turbine, small fire department, doctor's office, and a lion fill, which you will want the landfill for sure later on uh, because I assume there will be issues without it. But I'm not really caring right now for it. So tough. <laughs> okay, so uh, yeah, let's check the... Some buildings are out of water. Oh, because we probably... Some of our newer areas. Oh. It's just like slightly off here. And I built this off wrong. Oops. There you go. There you go. So yeah, we're going to bring in that cash. Look at that. We're making 3K and it's getting faster and higher. So let's get that uh, industry area in here because we can probably fit that in. There you go. So we got that done. So they can expand even further their industry up here, which is perfect. And our residential is going good, which is interesting because this whole new area is going to be our residential as well. This whole this whole little region is going to be industry. So, or sorry, not industry, uh, residential. So that was kind of the idea. We just have to wait. That cost a lot. It took every cent we had, basically. So we're going to have to sit back and wait a bit so we can uh, increase it more. But uh, it'll be worth it. Here's another set. So, yeah, we're, we're playing on the fine line here for fun. I probably overdid some of the infrastructure, like too many extra solar panels, water towers, things like that. Uh, maybe made the zones a little bigger and out of portion, but I just, I wanted to, I, I had fun with it and I was just, you know, just having a little fun, honestly. So it can't hurt. Right. Um, cause I'm sure the water actually costs something too, right? So water is costing you 80 a month. Roads are 146. Actually, oddly enough, it, the, the water and energy is just 80. It's actually not that bad. Okay, so uh, services, do we have, fi oh yeah, we do have fire and all that now. So you're going to want these guys in here. Um, oh no. Oh no. This is a good example of uh, failure on my side of things here. I was just building this guy now and it's just like, oh, I'm sorry, you are doomed already. So... We'll, of course, we will build these up, but the fire is going to spread, and you're going to hear boom, boom here probably. Oh, it's spreading. There you go. They're going to send out the fire trucks now. You can actually hit this too and like kind of direct them there. I guess it gives it probably a better chance of... Oh, I heard a boom. So we're going to have to go and destroy. So when it goes boom, I guess dark tiles basically mean it's a bad tile, so kind of you're screwed. Uh, there's not much power left, unfortunately, so we're going to have to build more power. Uh, do we have uh, supply, energy? We had that windmill, right? Yeah, the wind turbine. Don't even know if we have enough to build it, but uh, let's give it a try, shall we? There you go. 
So we're going to run out a bit of a power here in a minute. But uh, we'll have some new power here. Actually, it might be just in time. Yeah, it might need a bit of time to catch up. Okay, uh, services, police, not there yet. Okay. Oh, well, there you go. There's the police now. Uh, so you got one-way roads, water fountain, water fountain, small police department, taxi depot, and a cemetery. Water fountain's probably going to be needed here. So uh, there's buildings without energy. Oh, so now you can see the energy issue. There's buildings without water. Um, that would be probably more of an accident. Oh, yeah, here it is. There you go. You unlocked the lighthouse. That's kind of cool. Just more of a, a larger uh, little fun thing. Sure, we'll just build it in front of the solar panel. Okay. And... Uh, you re you're ready for this? These guys actually get affected by, oh yeah, transportation, things like that as well. Um, I was going to say, they get affected by other things too. From what I understand, even parks near industry is kind of a needed, vital thing. Oh, we got some crime going on. We got to get that crime thing going here. So we're going to get services, police department, small police. We'll get it around the center here. Because um, we, we don't want crime all over the place, right? And we're going to want it up here as well uh, over time. So there you go. Of course, we can't do so much right now. We're going to have to wait till uh, they build it. But uh, once it's built, it'll uh, help. Oh, they're pretty fast, actually. So it should be gone. Good. Uh, next thing you're going to want to build is that probably that cemetery, unfortunately, in the garbage. It's something I don't want to have to deal with. But uh, if you don't, sooner or later, you're going to have other issues, I'm sure. So we're going to do water or sort of waste disposal. And we'll just bring it up here. And uh, that's going to take a hefty cost, but uh, in the end, it'll be worth it. And then we're going to go and do another servant, or sorry, supply and funeral. And we'll build a cemetery. I'm assuming a cemetery doesn't really matter where it is. Like, I assume a cemetery here is okay, even. Um, we'll put it on this side. But uh, yeah. Important little things you need in a, in a town, I guess, over time. Okay, so let's do some roads here. Our town is doing really good, though. One, two, three, four. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. And we're going to go up. Oh, we did uh, one over too many, I think, didn't we? Yeah. Bad me. There you go. And then uh, we'll get another road put in here for fun. And then we will get uh, industry put in here. And then we'll get that water put into here. Here we go. So we'll get the water pipe. Uh, we'll just put it here, I guess. There you go. And because the wind turbine, yeah, I was just going to say, we probably want to do a wind turbine because we're probably going to have more power issues in the near future. And rather than wait for it, let's get it fixed now. So, yeah, the transportation. Let's look at that transportation. So, transportation and taxi depot. So, it costs 40 a month and it costs 8 k to build, which is pretty cheap, honestly. Uh, so, I would say building it, like, right in here would be the, the place to do it. So, let's build it right here. And interesting. Why aren't you showing the influence? Oh, there you go. That was weird. Kind of lost its influence there, so I was a little concerned. Let's place one up here as well. And this will make them happy because of transportation, right? They won't cry about transportation issues. But at the same time... Um, oh, ha health is an issue. Do we have uh, health yet? Oh, we do have a doctor. Ooh, I didn't realize that. we got to get those in here. Uh, so let's get a doctor in here, and let's get a doctor... Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on with the influence thing here. There you go. It's kind of weird. It just derps up sometimes. Oh, you know what? I didn't have enough money. <laughs> That's what it was. Um, it doesn't show the influence because I didn't have enough money for it yet. So that's why. We're just pretty damn poor right now. We're, we're kind of running on the thin lines of things here. So, But we're doing good. I think we're doing good. 
I personally think we're doing good. So let's go here and then one, two, three. I can't see here. One, two, three, four. I think we're off a bit. There you go. So one, two, yeah. Okay, so we'll do this to this. Excellent. We'll do this to this, this to this. And then, uh, yeah, I think more residential can be probably put in here, to be honest. The commercial, I don't think you need as much of it, but... Uh, Where is her crime issues? Huh. Oh, it was taken care of. So I say our police shouldn't be too bad, honestly. So, and we're gonna have to get some more water under. Oh, that part was very water friendly. Okay. Not sure what this is. A small mountain attraction, mostly flatland. Oh, so it acts like a park. Oh, that's kind of adorable. Talking about parks, uh, so we can do public parks, small beach. Either I'm really poor or there's something else there going on. Put that there, that uh, there. Oh, isn't that weird? I don't know if I was doing something. Ah! We missed our village uh, thing there. So we just hit village. You got avenues, a tree park, a town hall, uh, a village square, a transformer, small school, and a bus depot. Awesome. Uh, small school. I know, I know we need one of these, but can we build one? Uh, it looks like we can build one. Oh, boy. I mean, education is important. There's no, you know... It's just where do we get it? The influence area kind of sucks, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to give our kids an education too. I guess somewhere like right here. Okay. I bet you the education is going to eat our money quite a bit. Oh, yeah. Like you can look here, education, 100 a month for those. Not much power left. Damn. Uh, why? Uh, wind turbine. I guess wind turbine's kind of what we have right now. <laughs> Not enough money. Okay, I understand. There you go. That'll let us... Uh, be fine for a bit, but yeah, we're going to have to work on some of that. So yeah, look at this. This is cool. So you can click our happy meter, which is pretty damn cool. Religion is actually one that people are getting up upset about, which we can go... Uh, yeah, they, they do require a religion type uh, thing in this game. So um, I'm just wondering where to put it. We can put one here. And then we could have one over maybe over here. There you go. Okay, you gotta have a church everywhere, right? What the? Oh, uh, one of these did not move right, I guess. I thought I had it on the road, but I don't think I actually built it there. So I think I saw... We, we played with this before, didn't we? Uh, somewhere. There was a move a building option, so... I guess I got it? No, I don't know what's going on there. I'll just destroy it then. Yeah, I guess I didn't get that one church in the, the right spot. So we'll go back to religion. And yeah, we'll build one up here by the road. There you go. I don't think power plants and stuff is affected by that. Oh yeah, so these, like I said, they get affected by, oddly enough, parks and stuff at times. So if you look at parks... Um, oh, parks are 100%. Never mind. Screw that. I think it's a value thing, though, that they can be affected by, but uh, there's probably no demand for such value yet, so we probably are okay and don't have to worry as much, but um, so let's do more roads here. So we'll go here and uh, oh, look at that big village. So we got middle park, small church. Oh, so these are the larger churches, a gas plant. 
Uh, definitely worth it, uh, the gas plant, just because we don't have to deal with uh, this in the future. So let's bring it right here. I don't know if you need a road to it, but I'll build a road to it anyways. There you go. And uh, what else did we get? Because I kind of got to distract a gas plant, a small water pump, a fire department, and bus routes, or one-way bus routes. Okay, so we were going to expand this over here. So let's bring this down here. So we'll bring this to five. There you go. And uh, let's build some... I think I'll go commercial or industry again, or you know what? No, let's build some commercial here. We probably need some now. So we'll build this as commercial. And then our next layer we'll do as, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll get to you guys in a second. We probably better do that fast though, because they're probably going to get pissed. There you go. And we'll bring you down here. There you go, and you guys shouldn't complain anymore. And then back to roads here. Excellent, and then we'll build residential in here. And there you go. Ew, a Dutch windmill. Oh, look how the size of this thing is like Influence City. We'll put it right here. Right in the middle of the commercial area. <laughs> this is the nice thing as you advance, you're starting to get actually decent amount of uh, larger influence items. So like, you know, if you build a police department, which we're probably going to have to build a police department anyways here, or a new one. But look at the fire department. It's like the entire area where the other one was like, and just like a little, it was just, it was pathetic, right? But this new one is everything. So it's, uh, you know, it becomes very important to uh, do that. Do we have a police one like that yet? No. Um, education is kind of crappy still, I'm assuming. Yeah, education has a really bad influence area, but uh, people need to be educated, unfortunately. <laughs> I say that in a bad way. Unfortunately, education needs to exist. Okay, so, uh, yeah, so our new, yeah, our new expansion is going really well here. Okay, so I think we were off a bit. There you go. There you go. And then we'll do another zone here for residential. Excellent. And then we can do... Oh, we're going to have to get water probably under here. Oh, am I actually missing a middle part? Darn it. Okay, so we hit small town. We got dense residential, the dense commercial, dense industry. We got a harbor, expressway, a beer garden, a basketball, Angel of Independence, a sewer pipe, and a large police department. So, yeah, I screwed up something in here. So I'm just going to just increase this for the full size here. Okay. So our power overall, we're 42%. Uh, water... It's probably actually water is actually high. So the the new the new water plant thing here is probably going to be oh this requires never mind that requires I think there's another one you can get later on but that one actually requires um, there you go there's too much traffic on this road oh yeah so we might have to upgrade the roads here soon uh, I guess I can now even. So what we can do is we can go from here to here, here to here. There you go. And even this road, I think we'll need its upgrade. So we'll go from here to here. Yeah. As our, our, our city grows, the roads are required to uh, get a little better here, which is fine. And when we upgrade these, hopefully these will be enough for them to move around a little more freely. And even some of these side roads. I know I have to go like zigzag here to get these working well, but how much is that costing? Pretty penny to upgrade our roads, but uh, yeah, I guess dirt roads weren't quite doing their job as well. So I thought I upgraded this one, but either way, yeah, that seems to have helped relieve some of the stress there. 
and there you go. Our, our city is, she's growing. I mean, she's really growing, so that's really cool. And yeah, so I think that's it for this episode, my friends. We've we've done really well. We got to a small town. We have a nice flourishing city. We got a nice little industrial park here, which uh, uh, looks like we can finally work on. It looks like commercial needs a bit of work as well. We'll probably put some schools and stuff in those yeah, commercial areas. So we ate kind of the space there. But uh, look at this residential, 122 people there. Awesome. We're probably hitting a higher density now. Oh, yeah, look at this. And they're paying less taxes. So we'll have to do something about that next time. Anyway, thank you guys and girls so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.